Hello there everyone! I'm sorry this is like the third unboxing video I've done in a row here. Don't worry, I have other videos I'll be doing that'll be coming out later. But just stuff has been coming in the mail, so I've been doing these unboxing videos right now. And so I'm really, really excited because I got something I've kind of like always wanted, but I don't know why, I just never really got one before. I think mostly because of like space and then I was just like, I want it so badly, I don't care if I don't have space for it. I'm just going to get it anyway. And so that's what I'm going to be unboxing, but I also wanted to show you these two, two things that I actually got from someone else. These are from a different uh, seller. And this guy is the old Briar Farrier doll. And I'm just like super, super happy to have this because this is one I've been wanting for a little while. Like I'm, I, I definitely like these older Briar dolls more than the new ones personally. And so I'm just kind of trying to get as many of them as I can because, I don't know, I'm kind of collecting the uh, dolls now, I guess. They're just, they're just pretty cool, I think. So this is the Farrier doll. Uh, I don't know if my camera will focus in right, but really cool. He comes with horseshoes and like his little Farrier tools, which is pretty neat. So I am very, very excited about that. And then um, the person who sold it to me is actually also a friend of mine on Facebook. And she also included this super duper cute little cantering Welsh pony. Super adorable. I love this uh, Palomino color on her. It's really pretty. So I just wanted to add those two to this even though they're not actually a part of the next part I'm going to be unboxing here. Which we will uh, do now. Now I also had a couple like other little items with this. I hope they're included in here but uh, they should be. Anyway, let's go in and do this. I'm so excited right now. This is like Christmas morning. I almost thought about waiting till Christmas to get one. I was like, nah, let's just get one now. Especially because it might be helpful when it comes time for filming. Oh my gosh, it's so huge. This is a huge, huge box, by the way. I'm not gonna like try to show you how big it is, but it's a pretty big size box. Oh my goodness, here we go. Pulling it out. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's heavy. Wow. I didn't know it was that heavy. Oh my gosh. This is so, so exciting. Ah, it's a big truck. Oh my goodness. And actually the doll I ordered too is in here. Oh, what's this? This is part of the trailer. If you can't see it, there's part of the trailer. All right. Let me pull the doll out of the... Ooh, I don't know if you can see that. Here's the doll. She's missing an arm, but that's okay. I like customizing dolls and stuff, kind of. Um, I haven't really done it too much, but I do like doing it a little bit I have done, so I thought I could figure out something with her. We can fix her arm somehow later or something. So that's really cool, though. Another little Briar doll to add to my little growing Briar doll collection. I'll just set her aside. She's actually really cool. And then I also have another little item. I don't know if I'll be able to find it in here, but it's just like a little saddle pad. Oh my gosh, look at this big old truck. Like, I knew this was big, but I didn't know it was this big. It is huge, and it is so heavy. Like, oh my gosh, this is much more heavy than I imagined. It's got the little uh, tailgate that moves, opens and closes, I mean. Oh my gosh, I can't even get it into frame. This is ginormous. I'll try to move this big box maybe out of the way and then I'll um, set this down on, on my little filming area here. But this is the red truck. Oh, that didn't sound good, whatever was rolling around in there. I'm hearing stuff rolling around. I don't know what's going on. But wow, this is so cool. It needs a little bit of cleaning, but otherwise it looks amazing. I love the little horses on there. Two little like uh, ruffian mold horses on it. it. Even says model horses and briar on the tires. Super cool and the, the front tires seem to move. Oh, this is so cool. There's the dark tire. Woo! Oh my gosh. This is amazing. <laughs> oh, this is so cool. I'm like so sorry. I'm like just all excited. Ooh, it's got some spider webs. We'll have to clean it for sure. <laughs> but, oh, it's super cool. It's got like the little trailer hitch on the back. Oh my gosh. I'm like so excited right now. Let me set this down so we can pull out 
the trailer. Oh no, my light just went off. Hold on, technical difficulties. Sorry, everybody. Don't mean to make everything look weird. So, let's get this trailer out. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. I don't know how I'm gonna find... I hope it's in the trailer, the little saddle pad I got. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to dig through this lighter and look for it. But, okay, here's the part of the trailer from earlier. Alrighty. To figure out uh, how that goes on there. Or like, I don't know what that is. Part of the trailer thing. Some bubble wrap. Oh my goodness, and here's the trailer. Oh, it's so big. I knew in my head it had to be big to fit traditionals, but like I still, I don't know why like I'm for some reason like acting like I've never seen one of these in person before, because I have, but I just feel like I've always seen them in the box and never really gotten a good idea of just how ginormous they are. All right, I'm not seeing my saddle pad. I know it's gotta be in here somewhere, but I don't know where. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so big. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's so cool. Ah, oh, it is so, so, so cool. Oh my gosh. Here, let me grab a horse to stick in there just for the heck of it. Oh my goodness, it's got the little, uh, nah, nah, I'm not gonna even attempt to say words right now. But these little guys, this is so cool. And I know these trucks and trailers come in like all, there's like at least four different colors I've seen of them. Oh my gosh, it's nice, nice and roomy for him anyway. That is so, so cool. Oh my gosh, I am loving this. This is just amazing. This is like a childhood dream come true. Oh my gosh. This is super duper duper cool. All right, so now I'm going to try and lay them out so you can actually see them both together in frame or something. Oh my gosh, I still can't even get this in frame with the setup I have right now and I don't wanna change that completely so that's why I'm not getting it all in frame but oh my gosh I still just like it's so weird I don't know why I thought it'd be smaller or something because I have like I said I've seen these in person before I I don't know I don't know what what I was thinking but oh my gosh I wanted to show these cool little graphics on the side here they have the little uh Arabian proud Arabian full show jumping warm blood Smarty Jones and then the two ruffian molds on there. Really cool. I like the little sun. I like the Briar logo and this kind of neat like pinstriping looking design on it. So, so cool. This does need a little tender loving and care because it is a little, a little, little dirty kind of. And it's got like a little parts where it just needs a little scrubbing. No worries though. This is so, so cool. I love the little door that opens up here. This is just so exciting to me for some reason. I'm like, I can't believe I have one of these. I do not have room for these at all, but I absolutely, absolutely love it. Like this is so, so cool. And it has the little like trailer hitch thing over here, which this part actually turns up and down. Really cool. So I can't really set it up with the truck, I mean, maybe I'll try to in a minute, but I don't know if that's gonna work or not. Here it is uh, scaled up to my foundation stallion. So it is, I think it's like a pretty good size overall and just awesome. I know not every horse is gonna be able to fit in this, but um, well, let's, uh, let's actually experiment a little bit and see which horses can and cannot fit in this trailer. Also, I found the saddle pad I bought too, which I think is pretty. Pretty like kind of little westerny styled saddle pad so that's that uh, i did notice that this trailer because this one is used i bought it second hand but i did also notice that uh, it is missing one of the little this thing the little thing that like comes down and closes the gate so i'll have to um see if i would, uh, making one or something or double check that it wasn't in the box somewhere but anywho no worries as long as there's one that's good with me so I'm going to try now and just kind of do a little experiment 
and see which of my horses I can get to fit in here. Obviously the foundation stallion fit in there, pretty much no problem. Let's uh, let's try somebody else though. Um, how about this guy who is not going to fit in here. I do not think Winter Song will fit, but um, we can we can certainly try, right? We can try, see what happens. So far so good. He might actually fit, guys. Oh my gosh. He fits. Okay, I'm blown away now. This I'm loving this like 10 times more. Because I was already thinking, oh no, I'm probably not going to be able to like put hardly any horses in here for like Briar movies or whatever. Nope, he fits in there actually perfectly. Like, do you see him? He is all snug as a bug in a rug in there. He's a very happy little little big horse, I mean, a very happy big horse. Oh my gosh, I love the little ramp too. So, so cool, oh my gosh. So, clearly Winter Song fits in there. Um, I'm doubting Wixom will fit. I do have a Wixom over here. I really, would, really don't think she's gonna fit. In fact, I would bet money on the fact that she won't fit. Um, she's like kind of, ah, come here girl. She's like leaning against stuff because she doesn't stand super well. Hold on, I'm very sorry. This video is probably taking a turn from being an unboxing to a weird video. All right, here's a dusty Wixom. Ooh, she looks like a roan right now because she's so dusty. Oh, nope, not, ooh, maybe, maybe. Come on, girl, get in there. Oh my gosh, she fits. How she fits, I have no idea with that big gigantic butt of hers, but she fits. It's a miracle, oh my gosh, and she's not even like too long either. That is crazy. So this is like way better than I expected. Obviously it's probably not gonna fit horses that are really long, like um, the ruffian mold, surprisingly, since they have the ruffian mold on there, it's kind of like the little truck and trailer mascot. I do have a ruffian model over here. Let's see if she, she won't fit with her stand. I'm sure of it. No. Let's see if we can take her off. So this is actually black caviar. Let's see if she's too long for the trailer. Oh, oh, um, yep, yeah, she's too long. Not very, not by a very much though. Her tail just kind of sticks out in the tip of her foot. But uh, pretty close. Okay, and like models like the Peter Stone uh, trotting drafter here don't quite make it either. His, I um, hope oh, you can't even see that, but his ears just ever so slightly are a little bit too tall for the trailer. But I'm glad to see that more models than I expected it look like they're going to fit in here, which is pretty awesome. So I guess I'll uh, put the truck up here now. And see if I can hook them up maybe. Whoa! Oh, I just realized this is actually a little uh, little cover for this. And it's actually like a little chain. That is so cool. Oh my gosh. Um, I'm not going to try to mess with putting that on right now. This is just so cool. Oh my goodness. I wish I had this when I was like a really little kid. I would have had so much fun with it. But I didn't even start collecting the big traditional briars until a little bit later. Let's see if I can hook up the truck and the trailer here. I still can't get over how big this truck is. It's just huge. Oh my gosh. It's gigantic. Can't even get it in the frame at all. It's also cool because it does like open up the hood, the front, like just like super crazy detail in my opinion for like a horse toy in a sense that they have so much detail on the trucks and stuff like I don't know I just would not expect them to uh this is not going to close now I would not expect them to do a lot of detail for something like this that we are assuming most people are just wanting to put their horses in the trailer and take them places, not necessarily have a pretty detailed car model. But anyway, super cool. I just can't get over how cool this car is. So, big old truck. Let's see if I can somehow... Yeah, you can't even see that. Like, it's so, so big when it's together, too. It's like super long. Oh my gosh. I don't know if you can see this, but 
here's I guess how it goes on the trailer. I guess it just probably sits on there. You can drag it along. Oh, it's so cool. Oh my gosh, I'm super, super, super happy about this. Totally, totally worth the money I paid for it. It is, like I said, not in the best shape because it is a used one. And it is apparently missing one little piece, but honestly, I don't mind because it is super cool. I have no idea where I'm going to put it right now, but later on, I think I'll eventually like put it somewhere with my briar barn when I get those all set up. Because I literally have like four at least briar barns. Four? Maybe, no, I have like five or six. I have like two, two or three that are still in the boxes that haven't been opened up. So that's going to be craziness when that happens. And whenever that happens, I'll do a full video on that. But... Wow, this is like so exciting. I'm just so happy. Oops, sorry. He wanted to come in. He kept like falling over next to me. He wants to be in the... He wants to be in here. Here, can you fit up in here? Oh my gosh, you do. This truck and trailer loads a total of three horses if you want to get really creative with uh, where you put them. So that is the kind of weird unboxing review reliving a childhood dream kind of video. I really don't know what this was. Mostly just me being super excited about this. Oh my gosh, I am very, very happy about this. So that is all then, and I really hope you enjoyed this weird video. I do have a question for you guys. If you have a br uh, briar truck and or trailer, which color do you have? Or if you don't have one, which color do you want? I know there's this one, obviously this is the red set. The red trailer with the um, white, tra I mean the red truck with the white trailer with the red accents. And then I know there's also a dark blue truck with the white trailer with dark blue accents, which is actually the other one I'd really like to get maybe at some point. And then I also know there's a pretty green truck and trailer set and a pretty light blue truck and trailer set. And I don't know if there's a fifth color or not, but I know there's those four. So let me know if you have one, which color you have or which color you wish you had. Down in the comments down uh, down in the comments down below and i hope you guys have a super duper awesome day thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next video bye everyone